I'm here to talk about GS in CSS. And yes, it's GS in CSS because I was tired to add every time CSS in GS. So I want to see if we can do something with in the, in the other way. So let me just show you how it works. I will use <coughs> for that custom properties because custom properties, I, if you don't know, it's CSS viable and are very permissive. We can integrate lots of things in it that is considered as a value. And a string like GS is considered as a correct value. So let's see if I can, for example, generate a random color for my background. So I will write. Um, OK. So a random color is red mat that random multiply to five. OK. So I have to do green and blue. Green, um, blue, OK. And I have to return something. So I have to return a RGB value. RGB, OK. And I will use my variable green and finally blue. And as you can see, each time I, I tap, it's changed and generate a random color. So it works. The basic is working. It's cool. But let's see if we can go further and create some references, for example, or also inject some uh, some variables. OK, so I have, I have in mind that I have two parts here where I want to inject a different images according to my custom properties. If you have a look at custom properties, you know that it's impossible. But let's see if I can do this. I have my prefix. So I will write the right URL. It's the path of my slide. And I have a path. So after that is slash dot gs in css slash assets slash image slash. OK. And I will generate the URL, as I say, and I will inject direct dynamically my variable, which is image to use. So I will use my prefix. My pass. And finally, I will append everything. URL concat, dagger prefix, plus pass plus emg. And I have to return an URL. So return. There is a type of URL concat. You put prefix instead of prefix. Next question. Yes. Thank you. OK, so you will concat. Uh, I have to do this. And as you can see, image are directly injected. <laughs> so I won't explain to you how it works, because I don't like to have. I have the time to do this. But if you are quite curious, Please reach me at the pause and uh, I will enjoy <laughs> to explain you that. Thank you.